So guys, I am back with another Star Wars Jedi Survivor video and today guys, I bring you yet another amazing XP farm. You want to earn those skill points super super quick? Well today guys, I have you covered and this is real early as well, so anyone can do this. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so where I'm at right here guys is I'm on Koba, does that say the planet? I'm not even sure. But I'm at this meditation point here, Rambler's Reach Outpost. You can see that right here, guys. I think it's like the third one you activate here. I can actually show you that now because when you go to your meditation point, you go to that fast travel, it will tell you. If you go to fast travel, you can see. Okay, so I've got the George Crash site, but I believe that's where it starts. Then we have the Derelict Dam. And then we have Southern Reach. Okay, it's the fourth one then. The fourth one I've got anyway. So yeah, you can see where I'm at on the map, guys. It really is that simple. Okay, so from here, guys, you want to head this way. You want to head that way. You can see my line where I've gone back and forth. That's where you want to get to. There's a door up there, but there's about a good eight enemies there that you can easily take out. You can even take out this tree on the way if you want to. Well, I mean, if it's slowing you down, don't do it. You'll see these guys are actually... They're right there, don't worry about them. But yeah, you can take them through out if you want to. Normally they're all across in front of you, so it's easier, but hey. But when you come across here, guys, you'll see there's a little battle taking place. See, there's four little ads there, and there's a few ads behind them. So you can just take these out, do what you gotta do. I mean, if you get here quick enough, you can take them all out. And what I will say is as well, guys, the story, uh, the difficulty of the story, the way you, what you're playing on doesn't make no bit of difference whatsoever. So you can put this on easy mode, you can put it on hard mode. It makes no difference whatsoever, guys. And you'll see the XP I got is actually quite chunky. If you was watching the XP bar, I, I wasn't. I'll do it again. So we're going to run back. We're going to run back and come back here. Yeah. But hey, I've been doing it for about 5-10 minutes. And I leveled up my skill but three times. That's how crazy it is. I have been taking out these guys though as well, but I'll show you what I mean. When you go to the meditation point and come back, they do roll in front of you. So it is a lot easier to take out. Okay, so it's gonna go back here, guys. Because as you know, there's probably loads of these kind of things in the game as well. Probably better ones as you go on. But hey, for early players, this is perfect. So to reset the enemies, obviously come to your meditation point. And just rest and it resets all ads, resets all enemies, which is great. So if we just run back, guys. I ain't got my blaster yet either. If I had my blaster, this would be even better. Because shooting from afar, you don't mind. But you can see what I mean? These guys rolling in front of you. One stops. And you can take them out if you want to. You get even more XP. Just watch them when I go to that spiky mode though. There you go, it's a little bit of chunk there. And see my bar's about halfway now. Just above halfway, you can see it. So we're getting here, and you'll see the madness. You'll see the madness. I would recommend you taking out the, these funny looking creatures first, if you can, because obviously they will die, the other guys will kill him. And I'm getting blasted here, but it don't matter. Come on. That guy who's chopping me from behind gives you by far the most XP. So once you kill him, you'll see. You'll see the XP. See all that there? So that's quite a chunk of XP, guys. So from just above halfway, you can see where I'm at. One more run and I'm probably going to get this to another skill point. That's what I mean. It's super, super quick to earn those skill points. It really is. Like I said, there's probably better ones in the game as you progress on. Uh, the first one I covered, which was actually quite good. I'm not sure it's as quick as this one though. I won't lie to you. It's quick, but I'm not sure it's as quick as this. Again, I'll link that in the video description if you do want to check that out. But this is definitely an amazing one. We'll do it one more time, guys. I don't want to drag the video on too long. You know what I mean, you know what I mean people. You know what I mean, people. Again, up here, up the vine. And then we go on this way right here. Again, you can take out these dudes if you want to. That's completely up to you. I'm just going to take them out. 
That's why you gotta watch out for the spikes. Get out of it! Get out of it! And just run straight across here. There's a couple more ads around that corner, but they're not worth your time. It's way more efficient doing it this way. Wow, he just turned on me. Nah, mate. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> you damn. I mean, look how close that it is. It's basically filled up my bar. It's basically filled up my bar. So you can see what I mean. From two runs, guys. From just above half. You can see how madness it is. It's crazy. So yes, another great XP farm for Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Use it if it's the kind of thing you like. If not, skip it. It's all up to you. But guys, I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, leave it a like. It really helps me out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.